Hey everybody, I'm feeling motivated today to hit the thrift, so I thought I'd bring you all along, see if I could source some cool stuff from a Depop shop. I'm trying to be more selective lately. I have a lot of stuff that I sourced early on um, that just isn't moving. I don't think it's that cool. I kind of bought it because it was a super deal and I was just testing the waters. So let's see if I can pick out a couple of really cool things. We're gonna hit the local place and then we're gonna drive up to Massachusetts and hit my favorite spot uh, and see what we get. All right, let's go. some success at the thrift. We had some good luck at the local thrift. That place is great. I mean, it's only, it's usually I can get stuff for less than a dollar each. So it's a lot of the times I'll take a chance on something from there. Anyway, we found some cool stuff and now we're headed up to Massachusetts to the next spot. Tickle my dolphin. Tickle my dolphin. done at Goodwill up in Massachusetts. Goodwill came through as usual with a couple of cool pieces. Next stop is the flea market. Let's see what they have. Probably not much in the way of clothes, but they have some cool stuff.
was actually way more fruitful than I thought it would be. Check this out. Hey guys, we're back home. I'm gonna run you through what I scored today. Had some pretty good luck. The local place came through with a few pieces. Then we went to Goodwill up in Massachusetts, found a couple of things. Trying not to get too much, just trying to get some stuff that I think will move and that I really like. And then we went to the flea market and surprisingly found some really cool stuff there. So let's get into it. First up is this really cool Harvard University. It's like an anorak front pocket. Found this at the local place. So the price was incredibly good. I'm sure that this will sell eventually. Also found this super cool, just like very low key vintage Sears sportswear coat. I think that's really neat. Kind of has like Chinese communist vibes. I'm into it. Next up is this women's tee with the, with the Audi logo on it. I think that's pretty cool. My local place comes through with the vintage sweater finds a lot of the time. This is a neat one. Really cool, like 80s vibes. Are you into eagles? Yep. I'm trying to find more stuff from TV shows and movies. Uh, I did find this, Sanford and Sons. Great message on it. Wish it was my size. I don't have much experience with football gear, but I'm taking a chance on this because it seemed pretty cool. This is a Super Bowl jersey by Harrison. Nice Super Bowl logo right there. Seems pretty cool. In really good shape. Personal favorite here. I don't know if I can bring myself to sell this one. Calvin. Next up, we have a few single stitch tees that I found actually at the flea market, which I wasn't expecting to find there. These look like they're unworn too, which is pretty cool. Here's the first one. Printing looks like brand new, it's crazy. Same situation on this guy. Great printing, look at the, the cool font on it. Super 80 style. Single stitch, great shape. Last but not least, we got this cool old Looks like 80s, 90s sweatshirt. Hey, thanks for coming along with me while I thrifted it up. I uh, really appreciate it. And hopefully we can do it again soon. Sneaker dab.